Hi, my name is John. I've, I've played uh, tenor banjo for probably over 30 years, and uh, I think it's kind of a dying art. And uh, a lot of the guys that used to play have, have passed on, and uh, the guys that I I learned from. And so I thought it would be a good idea to um, put some tenor banjo basic stuff up here. Maybe we get some young people playing. It'd be real easy to convert a guy that plays mandolin to come over to play tenor banjo. They're both tuned in fifths. It's easy. So. Um, you know your your chords, your you know are going to be a lot like your know, first chord is probably going to be just like the mandolin chords, only they're they're transposed, so they're different names. But you know your your C would it's right here. Move it over, you have an F, and then you could do the old mando chord and get your G this way. Okay, and then back to this. I I usually do C F and G this way. Um, I'm going to go ahead and in another short segment here I'll show you, uh, I'll, I'll do it right now, I'll show you the movable system. So this is my, my, my one, I'm just taking the C and moving it up a few frets. And then here is uh, my four, and then here's my five. So up here, this, be, this is F, is actually an F chord now, because I've moved my hand up. This is my um, B flat or, or four chord. Here's my five chord, which is uh, C7. C7. So, I'm going to show you some pictures of that in a second, and that's kind of the you know that's the to get you going, kind of play rhythm. If you're playing rhythm in Dixie Band or something, that'll get you going. That's that's three chord stuff. Uh, maybe another video I'll go into some more uh, you know cycle fist stuff or uh, you know more complicated chord melody or some things like that. But I just, I want to get some simple stuff out there first. I don't think it's available, and uh, maybe get some younger players going or some other players going. So, all right, thank you. Okay, this is my three chords. Uh, the far left is the F chord. If you're on the fifth fret, the next chord would be a B flat, and the one after that would be the C seven. So the first two chords would be fifth fret. The next chord would be the last chord there would be uh, seventh fret. And, and the way I think about that is, you know, I think about this as my, my, my one chord, my four chord, and my five chord, and a move, it's a movable system. So again, it's for tenor banjo. You could use it on mandolin too, but uh, you know, it's real handy on tenor banjo.